Hey there, Cancer. Welcome to Share Ascensions. Thank you guys so much for being here. I really appreciate it. So uh, this is just going to be a quick general message. The way that I uh, set the intention for this round of readings is for the message you need to hear the most right now to come through, okay? Uh, so for you guys, I feel like there is um, a sense of like destruction. I was getting a lot of scorpionic energy uh, as well as Aries, as well as Taurus. So I feel like there is some kind of thing here. There's some kind of situation where I feel as if you are... Um, you know, realigning your values, you're throwing out things that no longer align with you, okay, so um, I feel like they're, you're breaking cycles, you're breaking tradition, um, you know, you're ripping some kind of foundation up by the roots, and you're rebuilding, okay, so there is kind of an energy of emptiness here, but I feel like it's because you're building something new there, so it's actually a really good thing, even though it might feel a little bit uncomfortable to you, okay, I was also seeing a lot of green, but it wasn't like a bright green, it was like a dirty green, okay, so I feel like there is a hint of like envious or resentful, or resentful energy kind of moving through your field here, okay? So this could be you, it could be someone else, but cleansing will be necessary, okay? Make sure you're drinking your water. You might also benefit from working with sage or cedar, okay? So those were the two I was getting specifically, but remember the water that is really significant as well. Um, I was feeling a lot of fire energy here too, as well as Virgo and Gemini, okay? So when it comes to manifestation, while visual visualization and uh, speaking things into existence are important. Uh, you have to have some level of action behind your words, okay? So I was feeling some Leo energy here. So you guys could be entrepreneurs. You could be in the spotlight in some way, shape, or form. There was also a Thomas Reed quote that came to mind, okay? A chain is only as strong as its weakest link, okay? So the weakest link is the strongest because it can break the whole thing. So consider the low vibrational energies that you are connecting with and chaining yourself to, all right? Because I feel like there's a new beginning you're about to approach here. Uh, there are certain things that you've torn down and throw out and thrown out all right but i feel like you need to take a closer look at the things and the uh connections the energies you've kept there okay so there could be some more things that have to go that's what i'm feeling here for you cancer i hope it was helpful i want to thank you all so much for tuning in if you would like to book a personal all of that information is at the very bottom of the description box but either way thank you so much for watching and you all enjoy the rest of your day bye